good morning dear students today we discuss process of sand casting it is important process for mass production of components basically casting as shown in figure consists of pouring a molten metal into the cavity and this cavity is formed with the help of pattern as you see in figure there is a cavity in which molten metal is poured this cavity is the replica of the desired component and that replica is formed with the help of a pattern so the casting is the manufacturing process in which molten metal is poured into the casting cavity or mold of desired shape and allowed to solidify within the bowl after solidification the casting is taken out by ejecting or by breaking the bowl so after solidification this sand casting is collapsed with the help of hammer or some mechanical means and it is ejected out so it is a very simple process and used in industries since long for mass products so uh, in the previous uh, in, in the upcoming slides we will discuss the casting process step by step so in very uh, first step a pattern is placed into the mold box you can see this is the pattern it is placed on the box in the second step uh, it is filled with sand and riddle is used to sieve the sand in third uh, step ramming is provided basically ramming is the packing of the sand now the for uh, pouring of molten metal screw pins and riser pins are provided they are located in the sand so that the molten metal is poured into the mold and the upper box that is called coke it is also filled with the help of sand and again ramming is performed to pack the boxes then after ramming and packing the Cope and drag box are opened to eject out the pattern, so that the cavity is formed. The ejection of the pattern. So after ejection of pattern, a cavity is left over in which we pour the molten metal. For facilitating the flow of molten metal, runner and gates are formed. after ejection of pattern so that the metal from uh, screw pin goes directly to the casting cavity with, through the route of in gates and runners after providing channels and in gates we pour the molten metal and after pouring uh, some time is given to solidify the melt and afterwards we eject the casting so this is the whole process of casting uh, which is performed to form a desired